looking for a young, ashen-haired woman. See anyone like that? Soon as I woke, I went to empty my bowels. My favorite part of the day. Suddenly, heard a bang. So loud, it couldn't have been me. And that lass appeared. Out of nowhere. Young, ashen-haired. Just like you said, she raced off towards the children's hut. Quick, as if the crones were after her. Hey, it's your favorite The Witcher Let's Play here. <laughs> so, uh, last episode we um, Watch out. Damn it. we helped uh, Johnny with his voice. It's clear, not a crone in sight. I need to sing to Gran. That ought to calm her. Little Johnny softly gazing, fire waning pale. Pop a spark jumped out and whispered, Listen, I'm a town. You... It got your voice back. I did. Though I seem to have lost an octave somewhere in the process. I shall look for it when I get home. You're not allowed here, Johnny. You shouldn't have come. Calm down, Gran. Don't get angry. It's not good for you. The woman I asked about earlier. Forgive me, Gran. But this fellow absolutely must talk to the ladies. No, she's not allowed. Please, it's important. The fellow will be quiet. Gran, please hear me out. I found little Yagna when she got lost, did I not? Did I break Jenny's fever too? I did. I ask anything in return? No. Didn't even fuss about my stolen voice. Well, now I want something. Gran, help this fellow. Because otherwise, he'll pester me day and night, even during potty time. His lass is missing. Perhaps the ladies can help find her, eh? Well, since you put it that way, Johnny, I'll help him. 
Come with me. Great. Let's see if these ladies can help us. <clears throat> Johnny's a good, good lad. Though the ladies don't like him. No. Foul creature, they say. Don't like him. Who are the women in the tapestry? Those are the ladies. Ladies lovely. With power o'er all. Beseech I thee. Answer my call. Before you a worm crawls, wretched and small. How dare you disturb our rest, woman? I'm looking for the woman with ashen hair. I know you met her. Where is she? Oh, he's impatient. Perhaps he only likes ashen-haired girls. It's clear you met her. Tell me everything. That was blunt. Well, perhaps it's for the best. Tell me. Have you got bollocks? Do you fear woodland beasts? Oh, hard times are upon this white-haired one. Brother has turned against brother. The land is soaked in blood. Evil reigns stronger than ever before. A dark power has surfaced near Down Warren. It feeds on hatred and disdain. Destroy the beast, and we will be grateful. Tell you all we know about this ashen-haired maid. Dark power? You need a knight errant, or a witch hunter, not a witcher. The alderman of Down Warren will tell you all. Remember to collect payment from him after you complete your task. And now our servant will bring you the dagger. A dagger? What for? When the alderman sees this dagger, he'll know we sent you. He'll aid with all. I'll talk to the alderman, but I can't promise anything. Move, woman! Give the young man the dagger. And you, white one, return only once you've completed the task. Oh, you mistress, right. On me way. Dagger. Gotta bring the dagger. The dagger. For you. Lady told me to give it to you. Here it is. The dagger. Place the alderman's payment on the stone. Stone bear. Stone shear. Stone nose, stone ears. Excellent, so... The ladies have proposed a trade. We are to destroy... Excuse me. Ugh. We are to destroy some foul beasts. Uh, from the woods or something, and um, and in return they will grant us the information we are seeking about Siri. <clears throat> Kimara, nice. Higher vampire. What's this? 
this place. That's pretty dark. Feeling these ladies aren't as benevolent as they appear to be. Right. Let's get to it then. We have a beast to slay. We must be coming home for more. Greetings. Nice village. Aye, a real <laughs> pearl of the swamps, if you say so. You get by all right? Aye, winter to winter. Somehow we survive. Recognize this dagger? Aye, master. I didn't know you belonged to them. Don't belong to anyone. Down to business. I want to get this done quickly. Ah, so that's how it's to be. I'm supposed to help solve your problem. Tell me what it is. Just the essentials. The war awoke an ancient power. An evil one that feeds on bloodshed. Nightmares haunt our nights and days. Folks sleepwalk from their homes, never to return. Under the tree on the Whispering Hillock they lie. Unburied, all. Oh, fathers, sons, daughters and mothers. Folk are afeard to move them. You must go there. The dark powers must be cast off. Need more details. You must see for yourself. Me grand's mum whacked me crosswise for straying near the Whispering Illick. But what happens there now is a wonder. A few times folk from round here gathered to chop down the trees and burn the cursed soil back to use. None returned. The ground neath the weeds is white with human bones. When did all this start? Three year back. I remember, twas a warm day. Went to check the snares for game. Pulled a hair from me trap. It grew dark all of a sudden, though it was nigh on noontime. Thought it was a storm at first. A squeal pierced the air, near burst me ears. The hair rotted in me hands, and the leaves shriveled and yellowed, though it were yet the start of summer. Times have been ill ever since. Folks' teeth turn black as charcoal. Women folk fight like polecats, bawling and brawling over nothing. The young'uns, born crippled, lame, fear and cursing. Long have we pled for the ladies' help. Ladies of the Wood don't know what this power is? They know all. Old Thecla claimed they'd be punishing us. Folks stop respecting them. Some even call them witches. But must not be they, for they sent you. I'll look around the Whispering Hillock. You be careful, Master Witcher. Don't ye treat this evil light. Let's wait for um, a more pleasant uh, weather to arise. This will allow us to regain our health. You, white one, what's your business? Yeah, that's Bloody a bit nicer. Good. Check out this uh, tree. It does sound a little bit spooky. Okay, this is
Take it easy. That's a groove. Get Just leave him alone. The powers that protect me, they sense whence you come. getting a bit eerie. It's not good. It's not a hybrid. It's a cursed. Oh, I never killed. I actually never killed a, a werewolf yet. Snap. Cursed ones, beasts. Hmm. Let's check out our character either way. Delusion. Be gone! Be gone! The powers will not 
relent. Okay, let's try to... Let's try to get this overgrown puppy. So... We have cursed oil. again. Is he even full health again? Werewolves are are, are very weird. Like, I'm, not, I'm not even doing damage to them. And then he just runs away.
I literally, I literally can't kill him. Nope, can't kill him. Might as well just fucking reload, I guess. I, I can't even kill him. What should I do? He's level 8. Like, it's so easy, probably. I just... Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll see ya. Kill you, so I'm leaving. Have a good life, whatever. Place of power. Should draw from it. Where's this stupid cave I'm looking for? Swords, just for nothing. Do I even have food? Yeah. What? That's not what I wanted. What? Stop it. Just eat. Free me, please. I 
must tell them. If something threatens the orphans, I'll help them myself. The children have been taken. Freely, please. I can't be a girl. A gallop unchained. I shall see them. Only I can. If you can save the orphans from the meadow, I'll help you. I will find them. Free them. Open the door of my cage. Blood is my escape. A rite you must perform. With the black of raven feathers. The white of my bones. And the swift steed. A bear, wild and free. In it whose pasture caught. Dark as a bottomless well. Black as the depths of night. Such a beast. No other. Gather these and bring them here. Where will I find your remains? My bones. They lie in a solitary mound nearby. Due west. Why do we need a black horse? The beast and I shall be as one. As when I lived, we shall be a gale. Nothing to stop us. A wild steed from meadows moist. Got some raven feathers. Find my remains and bring me a mount. A wind born a steed. A black squall turned horse. Gather what I need to free you, then return. Gather and return to the Illumix depths, to the tree's rotten heart. Pierce my heart. Let it blood to glow to be born again. I must first be consumed. Go now and return through the passage I have opened. Talking to trees and apparently freeing them from their imprisonment. This keeps getting weirder and weirder. Just when you thought it couldn't get worse. I should really get some like some better gear or something because I'm getting the feeling that this just isn't working like with the werewolf that was just that was just stupid what what, what now you piece of filth it's daddy <laughs> Seriously, this mud thing is so annoying. Dodged. Group fights are very annoying in the game. Like, it's really annoying. Can you stop?
how I Did it say I have another... how did I... How did I get another point, by the way? There's nothing to actually invest in, so... I should probably get... Uh, that's pretty good. That's very good, actually. Level 10. Alright. shouldn't yeah yeah shouldn't risk it yep no no I'm fine yep see ya later Raven feathers. Once I was free, I shall be free once more. I offer your remains. Once I was flesh, I shall be flesh once more. Sorry. 
Where is it going now? Took off pretty fast. Are oh, the elements here? Wait, what? Solved your problem. Just in case, though, avoid the whispering hillock for a while. Cannot be. Where's something lurking there? An evil spirit had possessed a tree on the hill. It was responsible for the killings. How'd ye dispel this evil? Went up the hill, took care of the problem. The details are my concern. I truly said. I knows naught of such things anyway. The crones, or the ladies of the wood as you call them, said to remind you about payment. Take it you know what they want? Aye, I do. Give me the dagger. Be back soon. Take it to the ladies, will you? What the hell was that? It is our pact. Uh, you're a stranger. You don't know life here. It's honest pay for their protection. So, all those ears in the woods... Put it out your mind, master. You soon be leaving and we must tarry on. Our young'uns and their young'uns after them. No gods nor masters watch over Velen. The land is no man's. He who wants to survive... Must seek his own protectors. Your weapon, young man. Mm -hmm. In real life, you're different than you were in the tapestry. Well, bring it here. Obeyed us once more. We are forgiving creatures, but you, you allowed the children to escape. They never wanted to flee. They liked it here. They played. Your punishment must be harsh. Now silence. We must speak to the white haired one. I know that, Mark. This is Anna, the wife of the Baron of Crow's Perch. She belongs to no man. A fruit ripened in her womb. A fruit sprouted from seeds sown by a man she detested. We helped her. She agreed to serve. She bears the mark. She is ours. Come, 
It is another woman who interests you. Speak, white-haired one. <laughs> Why do you look different now? Yeah, I, I prefer them. You looked different in the tapestry. We're all dressed up just for you. If you only knew how much time we spent in front of the glass. Do you desire us? You know why I'm here. You know what I want. You shall dream of us and return for what you reject. They always come back. Our deal. I did my part, now you do yours. A word once given, we never break. The girl. Mousy blonde. That's what they call it. Thin as a rail. Terrified. Exhausted. She could barely stun the poor thing. We cared for her as best we could. Like she was our own daughter. Wasted affection. She proved a very naughty girl. Mischievous, stubborn, and selfish. Don't believe you. They say you always keep your word, so tell me everything, exactly as it happened. We shall tell you, brave boy. Flashback time. We knew someone's supposed to arrive. We let beast and players saw the omens. We would glimpse her likeness. A mirage in a puddle. She came from the lower swamp. We knew not at first it was her the omens had spoken of. A child of the elder blood. The soul seed that would burst into flame. To our hands. Elder blood. Mm, the blood of the traitress. Does she sleep? Like a lamb. Come, sisters, no point in dawdling. The table's set. The cauldron bubbles. We cannot! You know she is meant for him! Imlareth will get her. He will, but not whole. <laughs> well said. We'll just have a sample. I'll take her feet. Lovely. I'm plump. Perfect for a broth. <sighs> I can taste it already. Very well. Get on with it! Oh, you'll regret that girl. Regret it dearly.
tried to kill her. Tried to butcher her like an animal and eat her. Her blood, the taste brought back the memories of our youth. Elder blood. Extraordinary girl. But you know that. Such a shame she fled. She escaped you, but I'll find her. We'll come back here together and kill you. You'll return, you shall. Our fates are bound. And one will die, but it shan't be one of us. Now you shall chase shadows and wander midst fog. Each time you see her, she will be a mirage. And if you find her, if the girl will <laughs> die, she <laughs> see you, handsome knight. Quite the interesting turn of events. It would appear we ran into another dead end. <coughs> Let's check. Um, yeah. So. Apparently, Anna is here, but she doesn't want to go back. I guess she's not here anymore. Good, so... Yeah, let's, let's do that. Actually, I didn't get to loot the, the werewolf those guys killed back then. Might have wanted to do that. Yeah. Just leave me alone, please. I don't like this swamp. I don't like it at all. Come on. There's something here. Need to use the eye. Yes, I know. Where's that artifact key? Stop. <laughs> 